Tip off brought to you by Honda, the official motorcycle of the PBA. It's great to have you back. This is the PBA Season 49 Governor's Cup here on Pilipinas Live and on PBA Rush. I'm Paolo Del Rosario alongside Coach Mark Molina. Bea Escudero joins us on the sidelines here today. Coach, you take a look at Glenn Robinson the third getting the first basket here. What can we expect from this guy? We all know that he has had this incredible NBA career. G League them pertain to trying to make sure that the play flows a lot better. So we'll see that in effect here today, hopefully. Here's Keith trying to back down Paul Lee. A scoop lane is good, and Rambo take the lead by two. And Bong Pinto is a very underrated post up player. He can definitely take it. Ray, but still not out the ball. Banquero flipping that around. Chris Newsom again pulls up for the J. Go good, still a clip hot. When you talk about effort year. plays, coach, that's him. Year in and year out, that's what he does. Here's Robinson the third. No Alan Durham here on the floor for the Morocco ball, so we'll see how they try to defend him. You, you don't see that often. Less than five minutes into this game, uh, an import sub got substituted in Baroka with five straight points here to give the lead back to Magnolia. You know, we're going to have to see just how the defenses are. A few here to Xavier Lucero. That slight nudge, that bump gave him that separation for that shot. You know, I, I admit, I did not have Cliff Hodge leading the scoring after the first quarter in my bingo card to start out the conference. As Jet Mendoza strikes back with two. And he did not start this game. Cliff Hodge. Yeah, and, you know, being there at the right time, that has been the hallmark of his game in the PBA. Black finding Durham inside. Ian Sangalang right there. Jet Mendoza with the double. They swing it around. And it all open for three. That's exactly what they wanted. It, it's obvious here. Magnolia will double. Here's Durham now. Gives it to Banquero. Banquero trying to get rid of Anmisi. Durham has it now. Got free for a second. Hands out to Banquero. Banquero's been trying that out. And he gets the first four-pointer in the PBA. Well, I can tell you right now, that got the crowd excited. Oh, yes. And that's a big difference. Four, four points in one shot. That's the value of that, that shot. And that's a good shot because uh, it came from a kick out coming from Durham. And you know that these PBA players, they're probably not saying it, but they, for sure, they are working on that shot. I can tell you that's right part now. part of the playing strategy here of Coach Luigi Trillo to rely a bit, maybe just a bit, on that four-point shot. Here's Laput. That push shot is good. We saw that a while ago on the other side of the floor, and he finally gets the two to go. Great find inside. Ian Sangalang, pretty finish. Now that is a partnership tale as old this time. Two defensive teams last year. 11-0 run. As Bong Quinto ends that run. They're going to need that from Quinto. Mark Baroka. Oh, what a fight to Glenn Robinson, the third. And that's Glenn Robinson showing us his athleticism. But what I like about Glenn Robinson Gets so the basket far. inside. Now here's Mark Baroka. Baroka goes at it by himself. And the veteran guard gets the two. And cue the timeout Back here. Had the size advantage. Here's Mendoza. Pull up four. Oh, oh, and he gets it off the back. He has the first back <laughs> four-point shot. And I, I thought I'd make a name for yourself, Mendoza, because you hit the first banked in <laughs> four-point shot. And Meralco had the first two four-point shots in this Alan season. Durham. Trying to finish it. And he can't get it go, but Cliff Hodge, right place, right time. And the Meralco bolts. Off with a trying to get going offensively, tapped away by Mark Baroka. Here he is now, Mark. Surveying the floor here. Lucero lines up a three. That is good. A great start here for the Magnolia Hot Shots. Three ball coming from Lucero. His first basket here as a Templadas hot shot. Now that's working inside. No good. Ian Sangalan on the defensive stop there. And it falls past Durham though. And Durham won't give up. He'll get the basket and one. And I think that is where he can still be. A forced Allen Durham. 
nobody stronger than him in this game right now. And Alan Durham doing his work under the basket here, getting the offensive rebound. And when he is that low, it's he is impossible to stop. Now Alan Durham control the pass. Paul Lee showing a double here. Durham now then drops in the third. Thought about it. Going inside instead. Find Ian Sangalang. Ian got Durham up. No good. He gets it back from Torres. And Ian Sangalang is still fighting. No finish yet. And the ball finds Ian Sangalang. And Ian Sangalang wow. finally gets it to fall. That's just determination on the part of Ian Sangalang. Led by Ian Sangalang. I like this lineup of Sangalang and Lucero together on the floor. This best move of the game is brought to you by Honda, the official motorcycle of the PBA, and Ian Sangalang showing us why you never give Playing up. together, and the chemistry is, is starting to be there. Chris Newsom gets the jumper. And Newsom has been quiet on the offensive end. That's only his fifth point of this game. Very effective. Jansen Rios, a 3 and 2 guy for Coach Luigi Trillo. James Lapo strikes this down. Finding Cliff Hodge, Durham. Sells for three, and Alan Durham. There's the Durham miss. And Durham has come alive here in the third quarter. A while ago. No, they are impressing here, especially in the third quarter. Oh, very impressive here. Very from from Milago, Aaron Black, looking well as for his team. Great find to the corner. And Mendoza, Cholo Mendoza, had a four a while ago, has a three now. That was just great basketball coming from Miraco in that last. Here's Mark Baroka. Now Paul Lee. Paul Lee for four. And that's what we've been waiting for all night. And that's a good time to take that shot. You're down 14. Yeah, you know, leads are harder to keep for sure. And because you got players who can hit them. But here's Mendoza. Jolo Mendoza with another three-pointer. He has been a long-range bomber here for the Brown Bulls. To Hodge. Newsom in the corner, and Newsom gets a three. Transition offense. Spin. Finishes inside. Paul Lee with 12 points in this game. Mendoza again for three, and Jolo Mendoza never leave him open. That was Paul Lee's man. Paul Lee made the shot, but he was on the attack. Mark Baroka. Looking for Ian Sangala. Gets Bates up in the air again, and he's had his number all night long. Well, we know, we know Ian. Very efficient. Not that time, as Meralco are seeing their offense start to sputter here. Now I like this. Get GRP in the low post. Oh, oh he, he has. Moves. He moves away, though. He gets the shooter's bounce anyway. Glenn Robinson the third, now up to 24. Oh, he felt that he had the speed advantage there. Banquero, great fight to have. And that's the speed advantage that Meralco is very well known for. Running the break after a missed layup by Paul Lee. And here. Eight seconds left to shoot here for Magnolia. Mark Baroka says, I need to do it myself. And he gets a two. That keeps him alive, uh, but that Baroka jumper. Now they need to apply some pressure here. Well, they're still alive, coach, but definitely also. They need to get it out. They finally, finally do. Lucero finding Glenn Robinson the third. Wide open for three. Oh, and that's a big basket here for Magnolia. I love the voice of Xavier Lucero. The ability to, to spot an open teammate there. Chris Newsom needs to get this across, and he does. Now they need to foul, talking about Magnolia, and eventually they do. And then Robinson the third with the shot can get it to go and that'll do it 99 to 94 to open up season 49 here in, of your PBA as the Morocco Bulls escape the Magnolia hot shot.